I once found my postman's finger. <laughs> oh, OK. Um, where? <laughs> on the floor in my hallway. On the floor in your hallway? Well, he'd been sliced off by the letterbox. Sliced off by the letterbox? He was posting a letter no. through my letterbox on a Saturday morning. And that doesn't sound very likely. <laughs> <laughs> and we suddenly saw a postman up against the window <laughs> with a finger missing. <laughs> he was banging on the window, screaming for help. And um, when we went to answer the door, the finger was just there. It was completely off. From where? From halfway? From his hand. No, from his hand. From whereabouts on the finger? From the top knuckle. You can stick it back on, can't you? And tape it and things yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. Before, um, before the hospital comes along, the doctor. We put it in ice. <coughs> oh. And um, he took it to the hospital with him. And uh, they stitched it back on. And did it still apparently. move? I don't know. I've not seen him since. <laughs> Had you previously noticed quite how vicious the action on your <laughs> letterbox was? Well, I've never posted a letter in my own letterbox. <laughs> so oh, you've, you've had, had to box. pull a bulky one through. Court. We all have. <laughs> and I have. What I bet happened is it came down on him and he recoiled in terror. Something that I'm sure Brian mm. could act with, with great. Imagine, yeah, Brian, you, you put your finger in, you got it caught. How would you recoil? How would you go? Ah! Something about that. Yes, yes. <laughs> that sort of thing, yes. Was it harrowing? Like, I, I'd find for him. that. Yeah. For him. It I'd... must have been quite harrowing for you. How yes, old it was. Yeah. I was, um, about ten. And who phoned 999 and said, I've got the postman's finger? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, let's be practical, you could use your other hand. <laughs> so, David, what do you think? Um, do you think it's true? I don't. I think it would have been more kind of affecting. I think Kevin's a bit laissez-faire with something that would have maybe stuck... Been he quite... wouldn't be able to tell a story like this yet. Because it'd be so traumatic. <laughs> yeah. And in fact, whenever anyone beckoned to him, he'd scream. <laughs> do you beckon to someone? Or do you beckon someone? Probably beckon. You're right, I've wasted a preposition. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you say, truth or, truth or lie? Yeah. I don't want it to be true, because if it is true for Kevin's postman, it could be true for ours, because... Well, no, well, suddenly friend. it explains all those fingers happen. on the doormat. Yeah. <laughs> I, th I think it's not true. I think the ice is too convenient and it... I don't know what I mean by that. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to say it's not true. <laughs> it's a lie, then. Yeah. Kevin Bishop, the truth or a lie? It is, in fact, true. <gasps> oh! <Yeah. laughs>